This is a charred daikon radish soup because one of my greatest achievements in life is being able to take vegetables that aren't potatoes and make them somehow taste like potatoes. And this soup came about because I was going to the farmer's market, but it was snowing and I should have known nobody was going to be there. But I knew that if I went to Mr. Kale, which is like a bodega, they'd have some interesting things that I could work with. I got some daikon radishes because I wanted to do something radish based no matter what, because that's kind of what's at the farmer's market right now. And the base of this recipe is really searing the daikon radishes first. If you just throw them in the pot and let them simmer, they kind of turn really bleh because radishes have a really high water content. And so without that sear, you don't get that caramelization, but you also don't get that texture that you're going for that makes them feel like a part of the soup and not just like this watery radish afterthought in the soup. And then the rest of the soup's really heavy on the aromatics, a lot of ginger, a lot of garlic, a lot of onion, and then blended that together with miso. And of course, at the end, that's when the radish goes back in to cook all the way through. And then tofu, which I didn't sear, but you totally can. And let that go for like 20 minutes. So altogether, it doesn't have that much going on except a ton of vegetables. But if you have a ton of radishes or you're seeing a ton of radishes, it will work with any of them. Hope Adam Driver would call it good soup.